March is Women's History Month, a celebration of women whose extraordinary contributions have earned them a seat at the table while paving the way for other women. The first Women's History Day was held in 1909. The one day recognition became Women's History Week in 1978 and in 1987 it blossomed into Women's History Month. This year's Women's History Month theme is valiant women of the vote refusing to be silenced. Women make up more than 50% of America, but only about 25% of Congress. Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg was an outspoken advocate for women's rights. As an attorney, she won landmark cases protecting women from workplace discrimination. She also fought for equal pay and marriage equality. Missouri City has a long legacy of women trailblazers, from public service to business to education. Mayor Yolanda Ford was the first woman and first African-American to be elected mayor of the Show Me City. Nine women have served on the city council, three currently. Other Missouri City women have run for office or served the public through their community efforts. Missouri City is a great place for women to do business. Almost 40% of all businesses in the Show Me City are women owned. But for all the progress that has been made, inequality and sexism still persist in our country. 42% of women still face gender discrimination at work. They also suffer from motherhood penalty. Women earn less money after becoming mothers while men earn more money after becoming fathers. Women who work full time and year round are paid about 82 cents for every $1 that a man makes. With that gap widening even more for women of color, according to the National Women's Law Center, these prevailing inequalities are exactly why Women's History Month matters so much. Missouri City salutes all the sheroes fighting for women's rights.